Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Woki, and I'm back with some more Master Duel here for the SP Deck Challenge. Um, I ended up doing all of them, actually, off-screen, as you can see here, that I got my Magic Cat here. Um, I needed to do a video on this specific duel, the Dark Spellian duel, because of this loner deck and this opponent's deck. So I'm going to be playing it a little bit, but I also just want to rant about this one just for a little bit. So that's going to be today's video. I hope you like it. Anyway, so this is supposed to be a kind of a reference to when Little Yugi dueled Big Yugi. Um, the only difference is here is that Big Yugi doesn't have any of the god cards. That would actually make it much easier to beat him. But no, he has a pure dark spelling in deck, aka the Dark Magician that they've misspelled for some reason. It's not the best Dark Magician deck in the world. It's very solid though. It's got three Dark Magical Circles. It's got one Eternal Soul. It's got a Mirror Force. It's got Secrets of the Dark Magic, and it has a whole bunch of like fusions he can he can use as long as well as the X Y Z monster. Not bad. Um, I would say this is somewhere around a a gold deck that can't beat any deck that's in Platinum, but will occasionally get very lucky if you get the opponent bricks or you just draw an amazing god hand and you can actually win somehow. That's what I would describe this deck as. It's not the best, but it's competent in what it needs to do. Here's the deck they give you. <laughs> Three archetypes, Silent Swordsman, Silent Magician, and Gadgets. This deck... <laughs> It barely wins silver. <laughs> the reason is, is that in theory, if you went all in on Silent Swordsman, went all in on Silent Magician, or you went all in on the gadgets, you'd have a very competent deck. But no, these are three archetypes mashed together. So for example, Silent Swordsman, absolutely useless if you do not draw Silent Swordsman level three. Silent Magician, absolutely useless if you do not draw Silent Magician level four. A brick in hand. A brick in hand. I would say most of the time this card is a brick in my hand. Easy bricks. This card is here because of the in the anime, this is the card that basically helped win little Yugi win the duel. And to be fair, this is a very good card. Uh, and it's limited to one because of the Thunder Dragons. It does not help this deck whatsoever. Only one of these, so if you don't draw a Silent Swordsman, this is a brick. Another brickable card. The best card in this deck is, I actually think, the Boot Up Admiral. I think he's the best one out of everyone here. And then you have some pretty good Link monsters. If you can get them, most of the time you're using them for Pot of Extravagance. This duel took me over two hours to beat because I got so unlucky. So I'm gonna try it here again. I'm gonna do my best to replicate. No, I'm gonna. No, fuck that. If you go first, you always lose. <laughs> I'm going second. The reason you always lose is that you have to actually hope to draw that you get Harpy's Feather Duster turn one, because otherwise he just wins. There's like no way for you to stop him. Okay, so we can see hand. Not not too bad. It's not a brick. Well, we did draw Silent Swordsman level seven, so that's useless. And so we can see here, Yugi's already got his. Ooh, it's not bad, but it's not good either. Huh. Okay. I'm gonna see if I can draw into. Harpy's Feather Duster. Because otherwise we're going to have some problems. Oh boy, we're going to have some problems. So, actually, I think I actually drew pretty well in this. It's, uh, it is unaffected by opponent's card effects. Okay. Let's see how this goes, huh? What's the worst that can happen? Okay. He's not affected by spell cards, right? Okay. I'm going to try to attack now. Yeah, that makes sense. Now, is this effect going to work on me? I don't really want to use it. I'm going to activate it now just because I want to get rid of Dark Magician, and then I'm going to Monster Reborn him to deny him his Dark Magician. You have to play so crazy aggressive with this deck. <clears throat> you have to really hope to against hope that he just breaks. 
because otherwise he's just gonna always automatically win. <clears throat> hmm. I mean, I'm gonna go with you because you're a monster that I could technically use. Oh wait, I could have brought him back. Never mind. I'm dumb. But now I actually want it this way because I, I, I don't want him having access to a dark magician. Alright, we're done. Go ahead, your turn. Huh. It's gonna be real funny after I was basically complaining that I, I'm actually just gonna win this turn. <laughs> It'll be really funny if that's the way it goes. I'll play a gadget, because why not? I actually can't believe against all hope that this is actually kind of working. Let's see. To... No, I don't want to do it yet. Okay. I think I might actually win with this. Unless he gets a Dark Magician. Can I forget? No, he can't. Okay. Still not dead yet. Okay. That's it. I don't have the greatest hand, but apparently he's bricked horribly. Oh god, it's Smear Force. I have a feeling it is mere force. I really don't want to activate his effect. Because I'm gonna lose my 38 monster. <laughs> okay. Okay, I have some plays in case things go bad. I'm gonna do this though. Okay. Let me see, what do I have here? I unfortunately got rid of all my gadgets, <laughs> so I can't link something into the gadget. Very unfortunate, but it's fine. I'm going to play red gadget. And I'm going to put Dark Magician in defense mode. I can't believe how easy that was. I usually, maybe after you beat him once, the game decides to make it ten times easier. Because, oh my god, he was a nightmare to fight regular. Let me see if I can do that again. Let me see going first, see if that changes anything. I'm telling you right now, he usually always drew the perfect card. I just got lucky drawing my, um, the right Silent Swordsman. Oh god, now this is what we're talking about now. Um, I'm gonna go with this for now. I can't believe I fucking drew Silent Sword the level 7 again. Okay, this is more like it. Gets the Dark Magician, plays it, plays another one. <laughs> to be fair, this isn't too bad so far. Oh no, <laughs> it's, now it's much worse. Oh no. Yeah, this is more accurate to what I was feeling. Actually, do I live this? Does he OTK me right here? The Dark Magicians. He can remove one of his materials, some of the Dark Magician. This thing's gone. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> I actually made the right decision. This is bad. He gets to summon another Dark Magician. No, he puts it in his hand. Okay, thank god. I can handle that. Do I die? Yes, I die here. He's gonna play the... No, okay. Why did he do that? Never mind. Do I live this turn? No. <laughs> no, I don't. There you go. That's what I was expecting. And before you say, what if, what if you put him in defense mode? He would have been destroyed then. Because if I put him in face-down defense position, that spell card would have automatically taken me down. That's... That's what I was expecting from this deck. This deck... has a way to just kill you. And it can kill you pretty damn easily. Ooh, this is actually very nice. Let me see... During I think I... Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. The unfortunate thing here is that I have to... There we go. 
It's based off of cards in hand, so. Yeah, you know, you're not getting that. Okay. Ooh. I don't want to feather duster because I think it's a stone tablet. It was mirror force just as bad. I at least get to have a card in my hand, which is nice. Don't want to play that yet. So, next. With my big old 2000 beat sticker. Bye bye. I mean, he has something that can beat the gadget. Should not be that hard. We need you to have the last cards in your hands. Come on, get rid of two more. <laughs> Damn it! You're a piece of shit, you know that? It's fine. Yeah, let me summon the level 4 version real quick. <laughs> I think I just win. Because I get to summon him. Let's see, what does this gadget do? I've never actually been able to play him. Yeah, don't really want to do that right now. Pretty sure if I just summon him, I win. I actually don't know if I want to get rid of the one in my hand. Yeah, I'll get rid of the two on the field. But if the reason that I want to keep them on the field is because it, it allows him to be immune to stuff. But if I keep one card in my hand, I'll be able to use Silent Burning. Okay. So far, so good. By the way, he does have the ability to just summon a level 4,000 monster if he wants. So again, until it is determined that he is dead, there's still a chance for him to always have a comeback victory. Never mind. Apparently, the AI is just very nice to me. Alright, we're done here. That's the end of the video, everyone. I just wanted to mention I spent a whole lot of time on this stage, and now that <laughs> I'm recording a video, it's going much smoother. But hey, I think this was actually the, this one might actually, ooh, I'm level 20. This is the hardest loner deck one of the new ones, and I think in general, what's the other worst loner deck challenge on here? I think it's, it might be under this one. The one with the locusts. There's like one where you had to fight with locusts. I can't remember if it's under World Legacy or if it's under a different one. Ah, uh, I mean, this looks bad. <laughs> Mech Strikers. Oh, no, wait, it's an opponent's deck? No. It's like too kind. No, that also looks like too nice. Might be under World Legacy. This might- this is the one I'm thinking of. Let me see, does it have Locust? No, it does not have Locust. Damn it, where the hell is it? This one. This is the worst. This- it's between this one and the Dark Magician one. At least the Dark Magician one ends quickly. This one is a pain in the fucking ass. Absolute terrible, because your loner deck is also this might- no, this is not the one. It might be the last one in here, then. It might be this deck. And confirm opponents like This is the battle. This is the worst one. <laughs> but anyway, that's the end of the video, everyone. See you guys next time. You guys have a good day. Have a good night.
Goodbye.